guys, today is World Play-Doh Day and Hasbro has been so awesome to send me this surprise -y kind of box of Play-Doh stuff for the World Play-Doh Day Challenge. Um, super excited about this. Play-Doh is always so much fun. So let's see what is inside this box here. Very excited about this. Um, it is very cute too. By the way, it looks like a little suitcase. Maybe it has to do with the theme of World Play-Doh Day. Open a can of imagination. Hmm. All right. So here is my challenge, I think. Reimagine your favorite destination on World Play-Doh Day. Join Hasbro iconic Play-Doh brand as it kicks off a weekend full of World Play-Doh Day festivities surrounding the global September 16th holiday. Play-Doh invites fans and artists of all ages to bring their favorite destinations to life. <laughs> oh boy, this is going to be a challenge. Um, with a creative Play-Doh twist, whether it's New York City's Park Avenue lined with purple Play-Doh alligators or <laughs> the Arctic Ocean filled with magic Play-Doh mermaids. The creative possibilities to join in the world of Play-Doh celebrations are nearly endless. So, it says enclosed you'll find a world Play-Doh celebration scene and we're inviting you to reimagine this location in your own unique way using Play-Doh. Alright, and then be sure to share your creations or videos of everything coming together with the hashtag World Play-Doh Day. So you guys can totally join in this challenge too and use the hashtag World Play-Doh Day. Post your own videos, post your photos. Definitely share your creations online, whether you know it's your account or help from your parents or, let's see, oh, they sent so many colors. Oh my goodness. Wow, there's like every color here. Oh, here's Penny. Penny, you gonna help me? Penny probably just wants to eat the Play-Doh. She enjoys eating Play-Doh, but that is definitely not a good idea. So they sent this little scene. That's very cute. So there's a little park, and there's also an ocean scene that you can use here. Maybe you can even create like a little world right here on this box. That, that, that would be kind of cool. That's fun. Um, hmm. Do I want to use this as a backdrop? I'm not sure yet. Because I'm not sure what I'm going to create. But first, I'm going to take a minute to think of some cool scene to make. And I will be right back to get started on my Play-Doh project. Okay, so we've got lots of colors here. They didn't give us a time limit on the challenges here. That is a good thing because I am terrible with time ch challenges. Um, so I think what I want to make is like... Something that represents New York City because that is my favorite place in the world. I live just a few miles away in New Jersey. And Penny, you want to help me make some skyscrapers? <laughs> so let's see how this is going to turn out because I am just, I don't know. My creations usually look pretty, pretty derpy. Cardboard works great as a knife. What do you think, Penny? <laughs> oh my goodness, this is already going to be so derpy. I just know it. But that's okay, because it's all about what you want to make. Right, Penny? Penny's like, I want to make lunch out of Play-Doh. <laughs> and that is my Empire State Building. How's, how am I starting off? Okay. So that's my one, <laughs> this is my first building. I think I'm just going to make a bunch of other generic buildings to fill out my skyline. Oh, maybe I should make a sky, like a literal sky. Okay, so I went to the kitchen and got some tools. I got a, a li literal rolling pin, which will probably now make all my pies and cookies taste like Play-Doh. But I really don't use this that often. And I plan to wash it after, so there's that. Alright, we've got a blue sky, you guys. 
Alright. I'm going to put back my stuff. <laughs> Alright. That is cool. Now let's make some more buildings because New York City has lots and lots of tall, tall buildings. All right, so here's my skyline. That's part one. I think it's, well, I think my Empire State Building needs a little work, but it's coming along and, well, if you know New York City, there's a few other landmarks I think we could use in this project as well. What do you think, Penny? She still wants to just eat some Play-Doh. Um, let's redo the tower here first. And you know, it doesn't have to be perfect because it's Play-Doh and it's about imagination and fun and you know, Play-Doh is just super fun. I love how it feels and smells. I don't know about you guys, but it is awesome. <laughs> that is better already. <laughs> okay, I don't think it looks better now, but... <laughs> I think my Empire State Building looks worse, but it's okay. It, it'll do. It's fun. <laughs> okay, now I need... Okay, so if you've ever been to New York, you know that there are like tons of taxi cabs everywhere. So I'm going to make a taxi for my scene here. Because, you know, yellow cabs, they are everywhere. Oh, actually this Play-Doh already kind of looks like... Oh, it just came out like a car shape. Ooh, that's cool. It's gonna make some wheels for it. And maybe like a little light on the top. It's a very abstract taxi cab. <laughs> I don't know if that looks too much like a taxi, but it will do. <laughs> okay, and now there's one more landmark I think my Skylar needs, and you guys can guess, and hopefully this is not going to be totally horrible, but I have a vision in my head of how it could look, and I think it could be very cute. Maybe you can guess by the color I'm using what it might be. So here is my final creation. It's New York City. We've got the Empire State Building and a taxi cab and a very derpy Statue of Liberty. I My apologies to the Statue of Liberty in New York and New Jersey in America for my creation. I'm not that talented. But I don't know. I think it's still kind of cute. It looks like a third grader did it. Probably third graders are better at this than I am. But I want to say thank you so much to Hasbro and Play-Doh for <laughs> inviting me to join in this challenge and sending me all this awesome Play-Doh. You guys should totally join in World Play-Doh Day and share your creations. And <laughs> let me know what you think of my 
<laughs> skyline here. And I'm gonna have a playlist down below where some of my friends are also joining in the challenge. So make sure to check those out as well. Be sure to hit that subscribe button. It's that little circle that looks like my face. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and you can watch some other videos that I'm gonna put in here as well. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for being awesome. Bye.